Hello and thank you for choosing premiumcards.net. This is a tutorial that will teach you how to prepare a file that will be used for printing business cards that will receive foil stamping. First we'll start by opening a new document. The size will be 3.5 by 2. Let's get this to fit in the window here. Okay, now that we have our artboard set and in place, I'm going to go ahead and add a background. And in this case, it's just going to be a black background. Okay, The size of it is going to be 3.75. That's the extra 2.5 is for the bleed. 2.25. If you don't know what a bleed is, the bleed is the outside area of the card that gets trimmed away when it gets cut down off of the uh, parent sheet. As you can see, the inside here that is the actual size of the card. The outside is the bleed that gets trimmed away. So I'm going to change it all black. And here's um, a quick lesson on changing it to rich black. Okay. 65% cyan, 45% magenta, 45% yellow, 100% black makes what's called a rich black. Since this is just going to be the background and there's going to be no color or anything involved in it, you could put as much color as you want. It could be a photograph if you like to, but in this case, um, I'm just going to save it as um, the color file by itself. So I'm going to save as Illustrator EPS, and we're going to call it um, Card Background Front. I already have one saved here, so I'm just going to save over it, replace. Okay, you see I just the preview I chose, chose none. It's not always necessary. Alright. Now, I know this is all going to be black, so there's really no um, bad position for anything that's going to get put on top of it. And what we're going to put on top of it is just going to be the foil. So, what I'm going to do, since that's already there, it's a black background, I'm going to go ahead and delete it. And let's just pretend we're going to put your logo on here. So this is just a font. As you can tell, I can still manipulate it and change it to whatever I want. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to change the font to our logo. Real simple. Type. Um, sorry, let's choose it here. Type create outlines. OK. Now I'm going to center it to the stage. And I'm going to go back into the color. And I'm going to change this to 100% black, which it already is there. Now the reason why we want it 100% black is because that's all you really need. This is going to be the f actual silver foil that will land on top of the black card. I'm going to bring the size up a little bit. Go ahead and hit save as. And it's going to be car card foil front EPS. That is the way you create files for uh, foiled business cards. So you have a black background and a silver foil that goes on top. You don't have to make the color of the foil anything. It just has to be black. This will be uh, turned to whatever foil it is that you choose when you print. And that's it. Thanks for choosing PrimaCards.net. Have a great day.